I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. Queen Elizabeth apparently has a secret code that she uses to escape awkward conversations. When Her Majesty is done talking to a guest, she simply moves her handbag from one arm to another, and her aides swoop in to end the conversation. Yeah, okay, I see what you're doing with the handbag there, Queenie Lady. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't done talking with you. Yeah, your bag. Climbing the corporate ladder could be setting your health up for a big fall, according to a recent survey. Researchers found when people are handed a promotion, they suffer 10% more mental strain. So, when offered a promotion next time, just politely turn down the additional responsibilities and just ask for the raise in pay instead. In Monroe, Washington, someone donated an old ice chest to Goodwill, not realizing the whole thing was packed with marijuana. They are trying to track down the donor and looking for someone with an incredibly large bummer. The military is developing drones with the ability to make lethal attack decisions without human input. If your name is Sarah or John Connor, you might want to consider a name change. Kale is getting a makeover. To develop a new variety of kale tailored to American palates, a horticulture professor from Cornell University College of Agriculture and Life Science are soliciting consumers' kale reflections – the good, the bad, and the ugly. The scientists at the college have been working with kale for years, so they decided to see if they can develop strains that consumers will want to eat. It's simple, yeah, you make kale taste like chocolate. MasterCard is experimenting with a payment feature in Brazil and Mexico that allows people to authenticate their payments with a selfie. Oh, just kill me now. Patrick Stewart says he uses marijuana daily to help him with arthritis symptoms. Stewart says that two years ago in Los Angeles he was examined by a doctor and given a note which gave him legal permission to purchase from a registered outlet cannabis-based products, which he was advised might help the orthoarthritis in both of his hands. When he needs a refill, he just uses Cerebro to log into the Walgreens website. The Trump administration's budget proposals includes billions for his proposed southern border wall while cutting funding for programs like Meals on Wheels. Hey, uh, how about you keep Meals on Wheels and just build the wall with the leftover sandwiches? A recent study says parenthood is linked to a longer life. Well, not in actual years. Uh, parenthood just makes life feel like it's taking longer. If you miss cuddling with your kitty during the day while at work, there's now a solution – kitty fur perfume. New York-based fragrance company Demeter is now selling kitten fur, which it claims captures the olfactory essence of the warmth and comfort of that perfect spot just behind a kitten's neck. Wow, you smell so great tonight! Oh yeah, that reminds me, I need to clean out the kitty litter box. Japan has opened restaurants called Owl Cafes, where people can pet the owls while they eat lunch. And if you pet the owl too hard and it dies, well then they'll pluck it, fry it up, and serve it with a side of biscuits and gravy. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more. And click that little bell next to the subscribe button to be notified when I post new videos. This episode is made possible in part by my Patreon supporters. For DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com, I'm Darren Marlar.